to patients with uh, lumbar spine injuries, which is what people recognize as the low back, the space that goes between the chest and the hips, those vertebrae are large and they require different forms of treatment. This is a model that shows the vertebrae itself. This is the front, the top, the bottom, the back. In the middle are the nerves running up and down that allow the body to move. Frequently, these nerves are the ones that are damaged when there is a disc rupture that pushes back, causing problems, or when there are shifts of the bones back or forward, or when there is arthritis that causes damage. To treat these problems, we frequently need to do different things. We can do something as simple as a laminectomy, which means making a little window on the bone in the back and removing a fragment of disc for something that is small. In some other situations, we have to access the spine first from the front to rebuild it. So we will take the disc itself out. That can be taken out in one of three ways. The anterior procedure is called an anterior lumbar interbody fusion or ALEF. The diagonal procedure is called an OLEF, oblique lateral interbody fusion, and XLEF, which is the extreme lateral fusion. So three different types for the same procedure depending on the individual. All of these three procedures accomplish the same thing. The idea is to remove the disc entirely, clean out the surface, and then put a spacer that looks somewhat like my thumb. It is hollow so that we can put bone inside that and that basically leaves it in place. Once that is done, the patient is turned on his belly and through the back we usually put screws in the back with bars that lock everything in position and hold it.